Blessings and blessings. The Corona virus. Oh, yes. Let's go there. So, uh, I want to start by saying, uh, if you resonate with this video, make sure you click the like button and you leave a comment below so that YouTube shows it to more people. This is my take. I'm going to call it the spiritual take, the conscious take on what is happening around our world as it pertains to the Corona virus. Now, um, secondly, I want to send my legitimately heartfelt prayers to anybody, anybody's family who has lost somebody to that. Same thing for anybody whose family has lost someone to suicide or a car accident, or let's take the statistics of mothers dying in the hospital in the United States of America, which is more than any other place on the planet, right? Or almost from a Western standpoint. There's a lot going on on our planet and it is very important that we keep our vibration, our frequency, our conversations upstairs. I have been alive long enough to have been around when the Y2K, the world will come to an end. Y2K, the whole world will come to an end at 12 midnight. The computers will crash. Everybody will crash into their cars and nothing will ever like be the same. That was not true. I've been around for uh, the um, mad cow disease and these different things that have been pumped and pushed towards us to keep our vibration and our frequency low. Let me remind all of us, there is only one truth on the planet and that is love. There is no opposite to love. However, we uh, live in a cause and effect universe where God, Buddha, Krishna, Jesus, Allah, source intelligence, whatever you want to name it, Google, whatever it is, if you say or type it in, it must say yes. So if you believe the fear mongering, the false evidence appearing real, if you believe that and allow it, allow it to penetrate and permeate your space, then your vibration lowers, which means your immune system lowers and you are more susceptible to some of the Mm, let's call it the man-made viruses that are floating around. However, we need germs. Let me remind you of that. I would be considered maybe one of the dirtiest people you would meet in the sense of I don't wash my hands all the time. I don't take showers every day. I don't do anything like that. Why? Because I know that this system, this beautiful beautiful, amazing skin suit that I call Preston, that you call Preston Smiles, was made in the spiritual image and likeness of the Most High and it is perfect and functioning. All the man-made stuff that we've added to it, yes, beautiful, I'll take it. I'm in a car right now, I'll take it. I have a hoodie, a sweater on, I'll take it, yes. And I'm not gonna be so fooled as to believing that my whole existence is based on what's being advertised to me at the moment. God is real. Love is real. Keep your vibration and your frequency high. Where attention goes, energy flows. So let's, let me remind all of you beautiful conscious beings out there to Take your attention off of the fear and the lack and limitation and the scarcity and the woe as us and bring it back to love. This is, this is not being stupid because there's a difference between being careful from fear and being aware from love. Oof, let it land. Hurrah! There is a difference. I'm going to say it again. From being careful from scarcity, lack of limitation, not enoughness. And being aware from peace, joy, harmony, and abundance. Rah! That is the game you want to be up to, especially right now. Because we don't know what's being set up. And I don't want to go too far into conspiracies or anything of that nature. However, do I trust the government fully? Of course not. Of course not. 
They make alcohol readily available everywhere. Porn is being pushed into every community that they can find. Opioids are going crazy. Do I trust the government to have our backs completely? Any government? Nope. I'm a sentient being. It is my duty, my job to stay woke. I love you. <laughs> Please leave a comment with whatever landed or resonated. If it did, if it didn't. All I ask is that we be respectful and we be nice to each other, okay? So if you are mean and you have mean comments and you call me names and things like that, I'm gonna delete you and block you. I love you from my heart, even if I delete you and block you. Um, please, vibrations high. It's all good. And it always has been. And it always will be. Don't believe the lie. There is a, uh, a virus of the mind that is being spread that is way, way deeper and crazier than the thing, the collection of viruses. It's a collection, including the common cold called the coronavirus. Peace and blessings.